Hey there, Internet. So, Groundhog Day. What is it? And where did it come from? Lie, 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 fun edited. Now, I realize I'm a little late on this one. Groundhog Day was technically Sunday, but I totally forgot about it last week, and I kind of wanted to make a video about it, so we're going to do that right now. Let's go. For those of you who don't know, which I'm guessing is not very many of you, Groundhog Day is this weird little holiday that we have here in America where a groundhog climbs out of a hole, and then he looks at the ground, and if he sees his shadow, he goes back into his hole because he's scared of it. But if he doesn't see his shadow, he stays outside. And based on that, we determine whether it's going to stay being winter or not. So, if it ends up being cloudy on February 1st, the groundhog won't see his shadow because there won't be any sunshine, and he'll stay out of his hole, and supposedly, I guess that means that winter ends on February 1st. However, if it's bright and sunny outside, then the groundhog sees his shadow, he runs away all scared because apparently he doesn't understand what a shadow is, and then he goes back into his hole for six more weeks of winter. Now, if you think about this at all, it's incredibly absurd because, one, if it's sunny on February 1st, I'm pretty sure that means that it's sunnier than it normally is, which would make me think that maybe winter is ending earlier. And two, why on earth do we listen to a groundhog for our weather forecasts, although it may be more accurate than most regular meteorologists? Anyway, long story short, there's this big celebration everywhere in Punxsutawney, Pennsylvania, which is like the home of Groundhog Day, where Punxsutawney Phil, I'm doing a lot of air quotes in this video, where Punxsutawney Phil is like the official groundhog of Groundhog Day, and apparently his forecast goes for the entire country. So I, being the oddly curious person that I am, decided that I really wanted to know where this absurd tradition came from, so I did a little bit of of researchy type stuff on the interwebs, which means I looked up the Groundhog Day page on Wikipedia, and apparently, lo and behold, it comes from English weather folklore. Who knew that was even a thing? Apparently, in this English weather folklore, there's more air quotes, there was some bear that was the prognosticator of the weather, and so every year they would look to this bear and see whether there was going to be more winter or whether it was going to come to be spring. I don't know where that came from. I only did one level of research, and you can look it up on your own. As for the specific date of Groundhog's Day, turns out that comes from a Celtic holiday called Imhog, I believe I'm pronouncing that correctly, which in the Celtic calendar was the first day of spring, and they determined that by the fact that it was the first day where daylight made substantial progress over nighttime, whatever that means. Essentially, it's where day started to get caught up. Whereas, of course, in our calendar, the Latin calendar, spring doesn't officially start until the vernal equinox, which is where night and day are the same length, and day starts to be longer than night. And so the theory is that somewhere along the line, these two calendar systems met, and there was obviously some conflict. So to resolve it, they brought in that English bear, or groundhog in the American sense, and if he went back into his burrow and fell back asleep, there was more winter, so the English calendar was right, and it started on the the vernal equinox, whereas if he stayed out, it meant that the Celtic Imhog calendar was right and spring started on February 1st. So I think that's pretty fascinating that it actually has some kind of historical significance, although the weather telling bear still doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. So I hope that this all was as fascinating to you as it was to me until next week, or perhaps next Groundhog Day. Deuces. Hey there, internet. So, Groundhog Day, what is it and where did it come from?